What's up everyone? Brake rotors are a vital component of your car's braking system. Without quality rotors, you risk poor overall braking, extra brake dust that can harm trim, wheels, and paint, and the annoyance of squealing and vibrating brakes. If you're suffering from any of these problems, don't stress. With new DuraGo brake rotors, you can enhance vehicle safety and limit noise, dust, and other nuisances associated with cheaper rotors. There are a number of options on the market which makes it difficult to choose the best one. In this video, we compiled the list of the top three best DuraGo rotors reviews on the market today. Be sure to watch till the end for our best recommendation. If you want more information or updated pricing on the products mentioned here, check out the links in the description below. If you have another product you'd like us to review, let us know by leaving a comment down below. So without further ado, let's get started. First we have Best for the Money Durago BR900524 This blank and smooth brake rotor is a simple design featuring no excess corrosion coating. The machined surface of the rotor is constructed from highly durable materials to prevent warping and ensure durability. Its pros are It is easy to install It is budget friendly The buyers report no noises during operation It has vane configurations which pull in cool air to reduce heat and its smooth finish eliminates the need for machining prior to installation. However, it may not fit in larger cars or SUVs, and some of its users report a short lifespan. Bottom line is, its performance is very high quality and consistent braking due to automated machining process. In terms of cooling, it has multiple vanes which remove hot air and pull in fresh air for efficient heat dissipation. And in terms of protection, its rotors last much longer thanks to added coating on hat and edges. Next we have Runner-Up Durago Titanium Series Brake Rotors These durable brake rotors are ideal for vehicles driven on a daily basis. An affordable entry point and long-lasting durability allow an affordable way to switch rotors without unnecessary expenditures. The painted hat center is corrosion resistant, but it may also appeal to drivers with a keen eye for aesthetics. Its pros are It has improved brake pad bedding It is manufactured in an ISO certified factory it has numerous vane configurations to reduce heat. It has corrosion protection on hat and edge of the rotor. And it has titanium gray finish which matches alloy and aluminum wheels. However, it may not fit European vehicles. Bottom line is, its performance has good braking power and a low price high quality alternative from OEM rotors. For its cooling, its brakes run cooler and better thanks to a very clever vane configuration. And for its protection, its pads bed in faster and last longer thanks to the non-directional finish of the rotors. Finally, we have Best Overall Durago BR5412302. This coating is especially effective against salt spray in coastal areas and geographic locations with harsh winters. In addition, these rotors can resist the harsh chemicals often used in car washes. These brake rotors are ideal for everyday driving or the daily commute. Its pros are it has smooth operation under heavy braking. It has similar fit and operation to OEM rotors. Its several vane configurations reduce heat. It has electrophoretic coating, ideal for rust prevention, and it has heavy-duty construction for prolonged lifespan. However, it has no threaded hole and screw on rotors to help with the removal. Bottom line is, for its performance, it has smooth and quiet braking thanks to 100% machine balanced rotor. For its cooling, it has very efficient heat dissipation due to multiple vane configuration. And for its protection, it lasts longer due to special electrophoretic coating protecting from corrosion. There you have it, our top three best Durago rotors on the market. Check out the links in the description below for detailed information and the latest pricing. If you thought this video was helpful, please smash that like button and consider subscribing. If you didn't, let me know why in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you in the next video.